Hi, you guys. Comment over here um, if anybody's here yet. I'm so excited. Ah, yay. We're going to wait just a little bit longer until we give people time to pop on. Oh, faith, my whole heart. So pumped. And as you guys are jumping on, um, Abby has so kindly dropped in the playlist link for today's playlist to go with our bar class. So excited. Oh, hi, Stasia, Kelsey. So many rays of sunshine. I love it. I'm so glad you guys are all here. We're going to give it a couple, three more minutes for people to pop on, and then we're going to get get our booties rocking in some bar class. Oh. While you guys are popping on, the playlist is listed in um, the comments. And also, if you have at home a weight, grab a weight. Maybe you have a water bottle. You can use a water bottle, um, a bottle of olive oil, literally whatever works. And then if you have a chair handy, a ladder, anything of this sort, just for like a little bit of a grip, a little bit of a balance, you're going to place that at the back of your mat. Place your weight or your water ball at the top of your mat. Oh, yay. Oh, yeah, Bethany, you're going to love the music. I got your go-to bar song on here. Get excited. I love it. Oh, Nicole, Maddie, so great. I'm so pumped. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. As a few more of you guys are popping on, the playlist is listed in the um, comments on the side. You can click on that to have some fun beats to go with your music. I will be just talking with no music. So if you want that, then you can just hang out with me. It's gonna be a great time. Um, like I said, if you have a weight, go ahead and grab a weight or a water bottle or maybe use nothing. You're still gonna get a great workout if you use nothing. Um, and then from there, you can grab a chair, a ladder. Maybe you just rest your hand on the door and be doing that as well. Um, or maybe you just use your core whole bunch and use nothing. Sound good? Okay, you're going to meet me on your mat and tabletop. Stack your shoulders over your wrists. Press your all two fingers on your mat. Take your gaze down. Hips stack over your knees. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, let it go. One more time. Inhale, fill up. Exhale. Inhale, gaze goes up. Drop your belly down low. Find your cow pose. And then exhale, chin to chest. Arch through your spine. Cat pose. Take this breath to move it. Inhale, gaze goes up. Exhale, chin to chest. Start to really focus in on your breath and ground down through this posture. I know many of you have probably been sitting at a desk, sitting at home at your desk, and you're like ready to get a little bit of activity to split your workday up. That's what we're here for. So unplug from everything that you've been working on all morning and take this 45 minutes just for yourself to create a little bit of energy, a little bit of happiness, a little bit of sunshine. You've got to stick with your breath, deep inhales, sharp exhales. You've got five more reps. Start to engage your core, knit your entire rib cage together. Belly button draws up into your spine. Still on your cat cows for three. Find a neutral spine in two and one. Exhale, tabletop. Curl your toes under, lift your knees up. You've got this. Inhale, lower little tap. Exhale, lift. Oh, yeah. Lift it, tabletop right here. Continue to stack your hips over your knees. Core is engaged a whole bunch. Little tap down. Lift up. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Maybe your knees just come literally to a hover. Or maybe you lift them two to three inches up off your mat. You've got this, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, oh yeah. Continue to maintain a micro bend through your elbows. Press all two fingers on your mat. Inhale, lower, little tap. Exhale, lift, slow and controlled. You're still warming up through the inside out. You've got this, little tap down. Lift up, and chances are you probably don't have 99 degree rooms right at your house, but I know a few of you are turning your heat up, so that's super great. Keep it up, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, you've got five more right here. Little tap, and squeeze for four. Ooh. We're gonna walk it out in three. Last two and one. You've got to find your lifted tabletop. Step your right toe back. Left toe back. High plank. Step it right back up. Lifted tabletop. Back to high plank. Inhale, drive it in. Exhale, step it back. Who inhale, drive together. Exhale, step it back. Now check in with yourself right here. See if you can find a flat back. Hips stay right at shoulder height the entire time. Little step back. Little step forward. Whoo, keep it up. 
you can, super strong through your upper body, super strong through your core. Little step back, step it up. You've got six more right here. Oh yeah, find your high plank in four. High plank in three. Last two and one, high plank. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. I love you actually start to pedal up through your feet here. Maybe bend your right knee, bend your left knee, shoot your hips high. Relax all the tension, all the stretch in the back of your neck and on the tops of your shoulders. Let it all go. Maybe you sway your hips from right to left. Pedal out through your feet. Feel the stretch through the backs of your legs. You've got a few more breaths. Whew, check in with yourself. You've got three more breaths. Find a still down dog in two and one. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, gaze forward. Exhale, inhale forward, find high plank. We're taking it right back into our walk. Step it up. Step it back. You've got it. Inhale up. Exhale, step it back. Ooh, this is your last set of these. You've got 10 seconds. Oh, yeah. Know that we're going to start to fire it up right away. This is bar. We're going to get some cardio going in five seconds. You've got it. Step it up. Step it back. You've got four. Keep it up. Find your high plank in three. Last two. And one. Find your high plank. Ballerina burpees. Jump feet. Jump up. Shoot your hands. Bounce it up. Inhale lower. Exhale lift. You've got to stay low for your posture at the top. I'm going to do a couple facing you. Inhale lower. High plank. Exhale lift. You squat. Inhale lower. Exhale lift. Sink super low. Know that it's always an option to step one foot up and then the other. Oh, yeah, you guys are rocking this. I know you're sticking with me at home. Woo, keep it up. Last seven seconds. Oh, yeah. Land in the top. Find your squat in five. Land in the top with your squat in four. Last three, two, and one. Land in the top with your squat. Just pulse it out. Heels in, toes out. Press your hands and hearts and your elbows out wide. Active recovery. Find a little pulse. Press. Squeeze. You've got this. Oh yeah, we're gonna take it right into our work after this. So get ready to grab your weight or whatever you have at the top of your mat. Give me four. Sink three inches lower, I know you can. Last two, and one, exhale. Hinge forward, catch your weight. Roll all the way up. Your weight or your water bottle or nothing at all is gonna go in your left hand. Maybe to your bar, right side back, second position. Heels in, toes out. Weight comes right next to your side for a server. Inhale, lower two, exhale, lift two. Inhale, lower two. Exhale up two. You've got this slow and controlled. Heels in, toes out. Bicep just raises your rib cage. Gaze is straight ahead. You've got it down for two counts. Up for two counts. This is a tiny, tiny little movement. Focus the two counts in on your legs. Down for two. Up for two. Little inch down. Little lift up. Oh yeah. Whoo. As you continue this movement, know that you can continue to take your elbow even higher. Inhale lower two. Exhale up two. To really start to burn into your left bicep. Palms up, weights up. You've got this bicep just raises your ribcage the entire time. Inhale, lower for two. Exhale, lift for two. Maybe you find a little bit of sunshine right here. Find a smile in your, in your face. You've got this. Whew, we add on in four. Hold it down at the bottom in three. Last two. And one, hold it down at the bottom. Take your arm up and out. Find a shoulder press. Inhale, lower, deep plie. Exhale, lift, front shoulder press. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. You've got this elbow stops right at shoulder height. Find a 90 degree bend through your arm, and then stack your weights directly above your shoulder. Inhale, lower one count. Exhale, lift one count. As you lower down through your full plies, drive your knees back, press your hips forward. Continue to find a flat back. As you lower down fully, lift up fully. Oh yeah, and then you want, if you want even more of a challenge right here, dig your heels down even more into your mat, and then see if you can find a little bit of air underneath your toes, lift your toes high. Oh yeah, are you feeling that? You've got this, stick with me. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, chest is so proud. Whoo, continue to focus in on your posture, right your elbow stops right at shoulder height. I know your arm's gonna start to fatigue, but you can do this. Know that you can always ditch your weight and keep your arm moving. You've got this down one count, up one count. Whoo, we're gonna pulse it at the bottom in four. Hold your deep plie in three. Hold it low in two, and one, just pulse, press. Squeeze, heels in, toes out. One inch up, one inch down, you've got this. Little press, squeeze, press, squeeze. Sink even lower through your legs, dig your heels, you can do this. Just press, squeeze, last three, sink even lower. Hold it low in two. And one, hold it down at the bottom, take your arm up to 90 degrees. Tricep extension, inhale in, exhale, press it out. Inhale, drive together, exhale, press it out. Whew. Challenge yourself right here to keep your elbow right at shoulder height. Shoot your weight and your pinkies out towards the center of the room. Inhale, drive in. Exhale, press out. And then when you're ready, sink even lower through your plie. Add your elevate lifts. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, heels come high. Inhale, lower down. 
axilla chills high. Oh yeah, you're gonna start to feel this in your outer glutes and your quads. You can do this, stay low through your plie. Maintain your posture right here. Arm is moving, heels are lifting, start to tap into your calves. You've got this, know that it's always an option to alternate your releve, maybe you lift your right heel, and then you lift your left heel. That's a okay. Maybe you ditch the releve completely and you maintain your plie. Whatever you do, keep your body moving. You need this right here. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Oh yeah, keep it up. Whoo, check back in with your core. You can keep it up for five. Hold everything down at the bottom in four. Just three for two and one. Exhale your weight to heart center. Take tacks. Inhale, lower to the right. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower to the left. Exhale, lift. You've got a chest is super proud. Weight to heart center, elbows high. Whoo, little tap down. Lift up. Know that with this posture, you don't have to fully tap your knees down to your thighs. You can take it a little down, a little up, a little down, a little up. Oh yeah, start to fire through your obliques. And then take three inches lower through your legs because I know you can. You know you can. You've got this. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Oh yeah, you can. Keep it up. Check back in with your breath. Sink two inches lower. You've got five more seconds. Even out your sides for four. We take it right into our mini hops in three. Mini hops in two and one. You've got a mini hops. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Actively point your toes at the bottom. Here's a side view. Here's a front view. You've got a knees continue to drive back. Point your toes at the bottom. Tiny, tiny little hops. Weight to heart center. Maybe you ditch your weights. We're going to build on to this. You can stick with me. You've got six more seconds. You guys guessed it. We're taking it right into squat jumps. You know I love cardio. You've got this for five. Squat jumps in four. Just three. Two, and one, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, all the way down, and up, all the way down, and up. You've got this, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, and press. You've got 10 seconds of full bone star jacks. You've got this, all the way down, all the way up. Glute drops down towards your mat. Know that you can take this to just a releve lift. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift, you're already down to five. Oh yeah, find your second position in four. Second position in three. Last two, and one. Exhale, second position. Literally give yourself a pat on the back. I know you guys just crushed, crushed that. Weight comes right in heart center. Find your first position through your arms. Inhale, lower second position, plie. Exhale, lift, first position, releve. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Active recovery all the way down. All the way up. Take this slow and controlled. Continue to step out through your second position. Kiss your heels together at the top in your first position. Isometric hold through your arms. You've got this, inhale, lower, plie. Exhale, lift, releve, high on your heels. Heels kiss. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Oh yeah, I'm breathing heavy. And you guys just did so much cardio, so I know you are. Take this even slower than you think you can. Inhale, lower, deep plie. Exhale, lift, releve. Whew, we're gonna land in our first position. Plie, releve in six. You've got just a few more reps. Find your first position in four. First position in three, two, and one, weight comes right to heart center. I so much of both your first position arms. We take it to one plie, one bat ma. Inhale, lower plie. Exhale, lift bat ma. You're lifting through your left leg. You're swinging through your left toes. Inhale, lower plie. Exhale, lift bat ma. Lift. I so much of both your arms. Same thing here. Maybe you ditch your weight, take it into your inside arm. Keep your arm active and lifted. All the way down through your plie. All the way up. It's kind of like a single leg lift through your left leg. Know that everybody's range of motion is going to be just a little bit different. And know that I can't actually see you. So if you lift your toes six inches off your mat, know that that is perfectly fine. And you're still moving and breathing with us. You've got this. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. I love the pace. Slow and controlled. Maybe your music is bumping right now. Maybe you find the beat. You've got it. We're going to find it at the top in six. Find your bat ma pulse in four. Bat ma pulse in three. Last two. And one, hold the top, just pulse. Press, squeeze, point your toes. Core is engaged a whole bunch. Find a slight turn out through your leg, engage through your quad, just three. Oh yeah, hold it high for two. And one, tap your left foot down towards your right, find a parallel chair. Left bicep, who's right next to your cage narrow row. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Elbow drives back, shoulder blade squeeze behind you. Oh yeah, maybe right here you chest your balance and take your right hand to your hip. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift up. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. You've got this one countdown. One count up. 
Can you lift a little bit higher through your relevé? I know you've still got it, but I know you can lift a little bit higher. And then really drive your inner thighs together. We're gonna add in our relevé lifts in four. Keep your narrow row going in three. Last two. And one, inhale, everything lowers. Exhale, lift, squeeze at the top. Inhale, everything lowers. Exhale, lift, and squeeze. You've got this one count down. One count up. Elbow drives back. Sink two inches lower through your plie. You've got this. I know you do. I know your legs are starting to shake, but we've got some really fun things coming after this, so I don't want you to quit on me. You've got this. You are not going to want to miss this. Keep it up for five. You can give me four. Hold your elbow high in three. Last two. And one. Hold your elbow high. Tricep kick back. Inhale lower. Just your hip. Exhale. Press pinkies high. Inhale lower. Exhale lift. Whew, one down. One up. I so much hold your legs, but I want it really, really low. Heels are really, really high. Pinkies high. You've got this. Stop at your hip. Press it high. Inhale lower. Exhale press. Oh yeah. Really start to isometric hold through your tricep. Movements from your elbow to your wrist. One count down. One count up. And if you have like the worst death grip on your weight or your water bottle right now, like relax your fingers. It's going to be okay. We're going to make it through. I promise. You've got this for five. Hold everything high in three. Just two. And one. Pulse it high. Just press. Squeeze. I know you can do this. Up an inch. Down an inch. Just pulse. Press. Squeeze. You've got this. Just press. Squeeze. Oh, yeah. Don't worry. We've got our watchdog, Murphy. She's on deck. No one's allowed to deliver any Amazon packages for the next 45 minutes. You've got this. So lift it just a little bit higher. Give me five. Woo! We're going to shake everything out in four. Shake it out in three. Last two. And one. Step away from your bar. Whatever you have. You've got to jack it out. Inhale lower. Exhale lift. Ooh, weighted jabs or no weights at all. All the way down, all the way up. Oh, yeah. Woo! Stay high on the balls of your feet. Really press through your weights if you want that. Maybe you ditch your weights. Maybe you even take this into a full-blown star jack. I know you can. Find a little bit of hype right here. Oh, yeah. You guys are totally rocking this. Stick with me just a little bit quicker. Ooh, you can. Give me six. Ow, ow! Oh, yeah, for full. Last three, two. And one, exhale, ditch your weight at the back of your mat. My bar is now here, so find whatever your bar is. We're gonna take it into a low bunch. Right foot forward, left foot back, single lunges. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Drive your inner thighs together at the top. Know that whatever you have in front of you is there for a little bit of support, but still find support in yourself. You got this, maybe take one into your hip, maybe take both your hands to your hips, because you can do this, you are strong enough. Now find a 90 degree bend through your front leg and then see if you can sink a little bit lower. Maybe your back knee literally comes down to a hover and lifts right back up. Down to a hover, lifts right back up. You've got this. <clears throat> Inhale lower, exhale lift, slow and controlled. Ooh, we add on in five. Back heel comes up and over the balls of your foot, give me four. Hold it low in three, last two, and one. You've got a low lunge to a coupe. Inhale, lower, low lunge. Exhale, lift, coupe. Literally, coupe means to cut. So you're going to tap your left toes on the back of your right ankle. Challenge yourself to stay super low for your right quad. Inhale, lower, low lunge. Exhale, lift. You're going to find a slight turn up through your left leg. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift up. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. You've got it. Gears point through your toes. Sink even lower. I know your legs are really shaking now, but stick with me. You can do this. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift up. Ooh. Check back in with your breath right here. It's going to help fire you through. Core is super engaged. Legs are shaking. You can do this. Give me seven more. These are your best seven reps. You're not going to miss this. Hold down in your low lunge in five. We're going to find a little pulse in four. Hold it low in three. Last two. And one. Just pulse it out. Just press. Squeeze. Press. Squeeze. You've got this up an inch. Down an inch. Your entire core is engaged. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Who you can do this. Stick with me, just pulse it out for four. We add a curtsy lunge in three. Add your curtsy lunge in two. And one, inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Find your normal low lunge. Curtsy lunge, low lunge, curtsy lunge. Here's the front view right here, inhale, lower, low lunge. Exhale, lift, curtsy lunge. Back knee still comes to a hover. You're going to start to tap into your outer glutes right here. Know that this can be you as well. Maybe you take your hands to heart center. Test your balance. Test your core. You've got this. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Oh, yeah. Keep it up. We've got six more reps. Ooh. 
Find your low lunge in five. Low lunge in four. Give me three. Last two. And one. Exhale, low lunge. Take it to a little tap. Single arabesque lift. Inhale, lower, low lunge. Exhale, lift, leg lift. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Whoo. Start to engage through your obliques. Continue to stack your front knee over your front ankle and really find a point through your left toes. Oh yeah, find your leg extension through your left leg. Keep it up, ground on through all four corners of your right foot. Find a sturdy foundation. Inhale, lower, low lunge. Exhale, lift, attitude lift. You've got this, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Whoo, single drop down, single lift up. Keep it up for four. We're gonna shake it out in five. You can't last three. For two, and one, option for hands on your hips or hands up. You take it right into switch jumps. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Maybe you step this out, low lunge, step it together. Low lunge, step it together. Whatever you do, I want you to get your heart rate up right here, right now. You are at the halfway point of class. You've got this, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Woo! Oh yeah, I know you guys are working so hard at home, but I need you to work just a little bit harder. You can do this. Oh yeah. You guys are totally crushing this. A little bit of sweat's gonna start to drip. You've got five more seconds. You can, give me four. Just a little bit deeper for three. Last two. And one. Oh yeah, heck yeah. I want high fives from all of you. You guys are totally crushing this. We're gonna take it right into the other side. I know you're dreading it, but we gotta knock it out. Take your, this time you're gonna take your left foot forward, right foot back. Single lunges, inhale lower, exhale lift. Inhale lower, exhale lift. This time your right knee's gonna come to a hover. Back heel's coming up and over the balls of my feet. 90 degree bend through your front leg. Inhale lower to a hover. Exhale lift. Actively drive your inner thighs together at the top. I hope you've got some bumping beats going on right now and you can find the beat. And tune into those just a little bit right here. Inhale lower. Exhale lift. Gaze is straight ahead. Roll your shoulders up and back. Relax the tension in your upper body. Whew, little tap down. Squeeze at the top. You already know what's coming. You've got five more right here. We're gonna add on in four. Find your low lunge in three. Just two. And one low lunge. Coupe. In a lower low lunge. Exhale with coupe. This time your right toes tap the back of your left ankle. Inhale lower. Exhale lift. Rise a little bit tall at the top. You've got it all the way down. All the way up. All the way down. All the way up. Little tap. Point through your right toes. You've got this. Stay low through your left quad. Whoo, little tap down. Squeeze at the top. Maybe you reach your palms up in front of you and just remove whatever is in front of you and just use your entire body right here. Little tap down. Lift up. Challenge yourself. Whoo. Oh, yeah. You guys are looking so good. I know you are. Stick with me. You can. Give me four. We're going to pulse it down at the bottom in three. Find your pulse in two. And one. Hold it low. Just pulse. Press. Squeeze. Up an inch. Down an inch. You can do this. Oh, yeah. Up an inch, down an inch. Whoo! Keep it up. You've got this. I know you're finding the beat right here at home. And then see two inches lower. Oh yeah, keep it up. Give me three. Hold it down at the bottom in two. Hold it low in one, find a low lunge. Curtsy lunge. You've got it, low lunge. Curtsy lunge. Oh yeah. Back knee to a hover. Back heel comes up and over the balls of your foot. Same thing here, maybe you take your hands to your hips. Continue to lower down. Lift up, tap into your outer glutes. Give this side the same amount of love, the same amount of intensity as you do on the other side. I know you've got it in you. Whew. Your legs are starting to shake, but you can do this. You are a fighter. I'm so glad you guys are all here working out with me at home. We're gonna find our low lunge in five. You can low lunge in four, low lunge in three, two, and one, find your low lunge, single lunge, single arabesque, single lunge. Single arabesque lift, inhale lower. Exhale lift. This time, point through your right toes. Whew, all the way down, all the way up. Start to fire up through your right glutes. Maintain your posture in your left leg. I know, it's gonna start to shake, it's gonna start to burn. It's already been through it on the other side, but it, it's strong enough and it can handle it right here. So see two inches lower and keep on breathing, keep on moving. You've got this, down one count, up one count. Whew, back knee to a hover and then lift it high. You've got this. Little drop. Big squeeze at the top. We're gonna shake this out in six. This is your last six reps of these. Keep it up for four. Switch jumps, very last setting. Three, hands up, give me two. 
And one, you got it, switch jumps, go miss a beat. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Chest up, chin up, you guys are totally rocking this, go, go, go. Take it just a little bit quicker than you did on the other side. You can, woo, oh yeah. Just a little bit quicker, you've got seven more seconds. You're not gonna wanna miss this, maybe you need to step it out, whatever you do, keep on moving. Ow, ow, you can for four. Oh yeah, give me three, last two, and one, nice job, you guys. You guys are totally crushing this. Grab your weight to the back of your mat. We're going to take it right into the opposite side. This time, left side body to your bar, second position. Heels and toes out. Squeeze your bicep right next to your cage. Grab your weight, your water bottle, whatever you've got. we got two inch lifts with a server. Inhale, lower two inches, up two inches. Lower two, up two. Now check in with your arm. Elbows high. Bicep is so strong. Palms and weights face up towards the ceiling. Down two, up two. Same thing here. I want you to take your heels down into your mat. Maybe on the other side, you started to lift up your toes and you were like, oh, I'm not really sure about it, but like now's the time to try it. No one can see you. If you fall over, it's okay. You might lose your balance, but I want you to stay two inches lower through your legs. Take your heels, like literally take your heels and lift up through your toes and take it two inches down, two inches up, two inches down, two inches up. Your biceps still working. Who you've got this. You guys are totally wrapping this. Keep it up for five. Oh yeah, you got it, hold it low and breathe. Down two, up two, last two. And one, hold at the top, we take it to a full plie. Front shoulder press, inhale, lower. Exhale, elbow stops right at shoulder height. Micro bend through your elbow. You can find your full range of motion here. Challenge yourself to maintain a micro bend through your knees at the top, but continue to dig your heels, lift your toes. You've got this all the way down, all the way up. Low core is engaged. Shoulders roll up and back, elbow stops and press. Inhale, lower. Exhale, press. Ooh, gaze is straight ahead. I know my shoulders are always burning in shoulder stuff, so know that you can ditch your weights, but I want you to keep moving. You can do this. Little drop. Squeeze at the top. Inhale, lower. Exhale, press. You've got it. Give me five. These are your best reps of your shoulder press. Last three. Shoulder press for two and one. Hold it down at the bottom. Turn your arm up to 90 degrees. Tricep extension. Inhale in. Exhale, press it out. Inhale, drive in. Exhale, press it out. Challenge yourself to keep your weight right at your shoulder height. Micro bend through your elbow the entire time. And same thing here, if you've got a death grip, release your fingers. I promise you're not gonna drop it. You've got this, inhale in. Exhale, press it back. Little drive, squeeze, whoo. Inhale, drive in. Exhale, press it back. We're gonna add in our relevant lifts in five. You've got to sink two inches lower through your plie. I know your guys' plies are looking so good at home. You've been practicing so much. Like, I know that they're perfect. You've got it for three. Add your belly weight lifts in two and one. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift and squeeze. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift. Heels rise as you punch your weight towards the center of the room. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Notice that I have an isometric pull through my plie and just my heels are lifting and lowering. Lifting and lowering. You've got this. It's going to help to engage your core. Maybe you have a wall. Maybe you have a bar to rest your hand on. Maybe you want to take it just a little bit deeper. Take your hand to your hip. You've got this. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Know that when you do that, you're going to need to take it even slower and focus in on this posture. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. You've got it. Just six more. I know. Your arms are running. You need three. Weight to heart center in two. And one. Exhale your weight to heart center. We're going to take it to the oblique twist. Inhale, lower. Twist to the center. Little twist to the right. Center. Left. Center. You've got it. Chest is so proud. Shoulders are still stacked over my hips. See, two inches lower through your legs. Oh, yeah. I saw you guys. You guys are totally rocking this. I know. You can. Obliques. We're focusing on our obliques. Ignore the fact that your legs are shaking and focus on your obliques. Elbows high, chest is proud. Little twist. Squeeze. Twist. Squeeze. You've got it. Just six more. Even out your sides for four. You've got it. Weight to heart center in three. Last two. And one. Exhale, second position, mini hops. Point your toes. Fall to heel. You've got this. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Know that we're going to build onto this, and this is your very last set of these building on. So I want you to sink even lower because I know you can. I know that you can work just a little bit harder right here, right now. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Elbows high. Now know that you can ditch your weight through this before we take it to our squat jumps in five. You can. Squat jumps in four, three, two, and one. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. You got it all the way down. All the way up. Whoo. Just cradle your right, right at heart center. Punch it up. Drop it down, punch it up. Oh yeah, pump your music up, you can do this. Woo! This is your second to last cardio risk of the entire day. I want you to dig just a little bit deeper. 
Oh yeah, you can give me six. Six more seconds, that's it. Give me five. Take it just a little bit higher for four, three, two, and one. Exhale, second position. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, let it go. Take your weight into your right hand. Find a first position for your right hand. Inhale, lower, second position, plie. Exhale, lift, first position, roll of that. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Heels kiss. Lower down. Lift it up. All the way down for your plie. Rise high through your relevé at the top. Heels meet and kiss at the top. Point your toes out wide. And then glue your inner thighs together as you find a little momentum from your plie to your relevé. You've got this. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Isometrical through your arms. Elbows high. Whew, you can do this. Little drop. Squeeze at the top. You've got seven more reps. Oh, yeah. This is one of my favorite transitions. You've got it for five. Hold your first position, releve in three. First position, releve, find your plie in two. And one, find your plie, sink down, heels kiss. Arm stays right at heart center. We take it to one plie, bat ma, single plie, single bat ma. Inhale, lower. Exhale, it feels like you're taking a single leg lift through your right leg, point through your right toes. Elbows high. Same thing, notice my fingers are still moving. You don't have to take a death grip. We're all gonna be fine, we're already all in our houses. We're comfortable, everything's great, no one can see us. Like, it's gonna be great. You guys are powering through this. I'm so proud that you guys are all here. Keep it up. See, even lower through your plie. Heels are still kissed together. You've got this, inhale lower. Exhale, lift, find your bottom, I'll give you four. Pulse it high in three. Pulse it high in two. And one, just pulse, press. Squeeze, shoulders roll back, just press. Squeeze, point through your right toes, you've got it for five. Pulse it out, you can. Just three, two, and one. Exhale, release, plant your right foot next to your left. Find a parallel chair. Drop your weight down towards your knee, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, narrow row. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Bicep just raises your ribcage. Elbow drives up and back. Find a slight hinge forward through your upper body. Knit your entire ribcage together. You've got this, little tap down. Squeeze at the top, tap down. Squeeze at the top. We add our releve lifts in four. Releve lifts coming in hot in three. Give me two. And one. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift and squeeze. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift and squeeze. You've got this. Sink even lower through your plie. Focus in on just your releve of your legs moving. Heels drop. Heels lift. Heels drop. Heels lift. I, I wish I could see everyone's smiling faces because, like, smiling is obviously my favorite. So smile right here, right now. If it's not for you, it's for me. Like, it's going to be great. You've got five more reps. Hold your elbow high in four. You've got it even lower, give me three. Hold it high, last two. And one, elbow side, tricep kickbacks. Inhale, lower, exhale, press. Little drop, squeeze, inhale, lower. Exhale, press. You've got it, pinkies high, elbows high. Maintain your side inch forward. I still measure hold your legs. Basically hold it right there. But know that if you wanna dig just a little bit deeper, you can sink a little bit lower through your plie. Lift a little bit higher through your releve, but I want your triceps still working. Inhale, lower. Exhale, press. Little drop. Squeeze at the top. Oh, yeah, give me four. Find your tricep pulse in three. Last two. And one, pinky side, just pulse. Press. Squeeze, engage your core a whole bunch. Maybe you take your left fingertips towards your left hip. Oh, yeah. Find a little bit of balance right here. Pinky side, just press. Squeeze for three. Cardio in two and one. Weighted jacks. Inhale, lower. Exhale, press. You've got to jack it up. Maybe then, maybe you ditch your weight on this one and take it right into star jacks. This is your very last cardio verse of the entire day. Find a little bit of height. You've got to push yourself just a little bit more. I know you can do this. Maybe you step it out. Oh, yeah. I know you've got this going on, Bethany. Keep it up. Woo! Ow, ow! You can last five. Take just a little bit deeper. Give me four. Last three. Two, and one, exhale your weight to heart center. You take it right into suicide squats, inhale lower down. Exhale, lift up, inhale lower. Exhale, lift out to recovery right here. Maybe you alternate which knee you tap down and lift up each and every time. I challenge you to stay low through your legs. If this is really hard on your knees, maybe you hold it down, lower and lift, or maybe you hold your narrow squat and just pulse. You're here for 10 more seconds. You've got this lower all the way down. Lift it all the way up. I promise we're gonna take it down to our mount after this. Ooh, don't worry, we're not cooling down yet. We got a little bit more hard work to do. You've got it for four. Drop it down to your knees in three. Last two. And one, drop down to your knees. Ditch your weight at the top of your mat. We're gonna take it right into a tilted tabletop. 
So plant your forearms down on your mat, plant your palms down. Hips still stack over your knees. Ground down for your left foot, extend your right leg back on behind you for singles. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Inhale, lower down, exhale, lift up. Square your hips down towards your mat. Engage your core, you've got a little tap down. Squeeze at the top, your shoulders stack directly over your elbows. Ooh, inhale, lower, exhale, lift. Oh yeah, one count down, one count up. Know that you can always do this from a normal table tap, but I notice that you can get a little bit more range of motion if you take it down to your forearms. You're gonna have to engage your core just a little bit more, find a sturdy foundation, and then focus in on your right leg. Down for one, up for one, down for one, up for one. I know we got some Speedy Gonzalez's out there, so I'm just here to like keep you going slow because I'm also a Speedy Gonzalez, like Casey didn't know. So I normally take it really, really fast, but I want you to take it really, really slow. You can give me five. Ooh. You're gonna pulse out of the top in four. Right leg's high in three. Give me two and one right leg's high, just pulse. Press, squeeze, tiny, tiny little movements. You bet, up an inch, down an inch. Fierce point through your toes. Jack back in with your core. Swear your right hip down towards your mat. You've got it, up an inch, down an inch. You can, give me three. Oh yeah, we take it to rainbow, taps in two. And one, tap it over to the left. Center, right, center. Left, center, right, center. You've got this inhale, lower all the way down, tap. Exhale, lift and squeeze. Know that you can make this as big and as small as you want your rainbow to be today, but I want you to try to find a pause at the top and really engage your glutes. Make this distinct movements down to the left. Hold it, center, down to the right. Hold it, center, you've got it. Oh yeah, I know you guys are creating some beautiful rainbows right now, right here. You can, keep it up. You've got five more reps. Whoo, we hold it at the top in four. Hold your right leg high in three. Just two and one. Hold your right leg high. Tiny soften. Press. Tiny soften. Press. Take a little bend. Big extend. Little bend. Big extend. Flex your toes. Sink your heels. You've got a tiny bend. And press. Bend. And press. You can do this. Right leg is still high. Oh, yeah. Little bend. Big extension. Feel as if you could literally stamp your heel and close the door behind you. Flex your toes a whole bunch back towards your body. Stamp your heel. Little bend. Big extend, you've got it, inhale, bend. Exhale, press, keep it up, just six more. Oh, you can. Oh yeah, we're gonna add on in four. Little bend, big extend in three. Last two, and one, press it all the way up towards your palms. We got teeter-totter push-ups. Walk your palms out to the sides of your mat, inhale, lower. Exhale, let your right leg is still extended. Notice that your left leg is still down, and we're acting like we're teeter-totters, you've got this. Oh, inhale, lower. Excellent. You didn't know this was kids yoga, but here we are. No, no, you got this. Keep it up. You've got 10 more reps. These are your only sets of push-ups for the entire day. Little drop. Squeeze at the top. Oh, yeah. Wide arm push-ups. Elbows out wide. Shoulder blade squeeze. Who continue to engage your core. You've got this. Give me four. Oh, yeah. Last three. For two. And one. Exhale, release. Shake your hands out. We're going to take it right into the other side. Punch your forearms down. Tilted tabletop. Palms went down, ground down through your right leg this time. Extend your left leg back on for singles. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Little drop. Squeeze. Drop. Squeeze. Core is engaged. Gaze is straight down. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Oh, yeah. Fierce point through your toes. Tap it all the way down. Lift it all the way up. Oh, yeah. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift up. This time, check in with your left hip. Square your left hip down towards your mat. Hips are squared. Core is engaged and it's your entire rib cage together. You know we have core work after this. So why not start it just a little bit early, am I right? Yeah, I know. That's what I thought. Keep it up for four. Pulse it at the top in three. Find your pulse in two and one. Hold it high, just pulse. Press, squeeze, little press. Squeeze, give me three. Pulse it out, last two. And one, hold it high, rainbow taps, inhale lower. Exhale, lift, inhale lower to the right. Exhale, lift, little drop to the right. Squeeze at the top, drop, and squeeze. Challenge yourself to find the same rainbow that you created on the other side. I know it's kind of a tricky concept, but like maybe you'll find the full range of motion on this side as you did on the other side. We're creating super big, beautiful rainbows because we all need it, am I right? Yeah, it's gonna be super great. You've got this, inhale lower, exhale lift. Oh yeah, you've got seven more reps. Continue to take, take this slow and controlled. Your breath is gonna help power you through, through the last few minutes of class. You can give me four. Hold it at the top and breathe. Hold your leg high in two. And one left leg high, trying to stop it. 
Press, tiny bend. Extend, flex your toes, stamp your heels. You got a little bend. Press, bend, press. You can, hips still square towards your mat. Oh yeah. We're still closing all the doors in the house with your heel. You've got a little bend, big extend. Soften and press for six. Ooh, left leg still high. Keep it up. Oh yeah. So strong, give me four. Keep it up for three. Just two. And one, press it all the way up. Find your teeter totter push ups. Walk your palms out wide, or maybe you want tricep push ups. Walk your palms underneath your shoulders. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. On your tricep push ups, bicep, just raise your ribcage. I gotta say, right here, right now is a good time to try your tricep push ups. One, you've got one knee on the ground, one leg lifted. Two, no one can see you. And I know you're totally rocking it. So challenge yourself right here. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. You've got 10 more tricep push ups. Ooh, I know, we did a lot of tricep work today. Keep it up. One count down, one count up. Ooh, deep inhales for four. You can, maybe three. Last two, and one. Exhale, release, roll all the way down onto your back. Once you make it down to your back, take your legs up to 90 degrees, 45 degrees. Place the palms, pinch your palms behind your ears. We take it right into passe slides. Inhale, lower your left leg down. Exhale, lift it back up. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. So you've got it down and up. Here's going through your toes. Whew. Melt your belly button down in towards your spine. Low back melts down into your mat. I have so much you hold through your right leg. You've got a tiny lower. Lift. Lower. Lift. Now I know that I said 45 degrees, but know that I want you to keep your legs wherever it's comfortable for you. So maybe you literally plant your right foot down on your mat and you're just sliding through your left leg and that's okay. You can be there right here, right now. Inhale, lower. Exhale, press. Ooh, keep it up. All the way down. All the way up. Give me four. We switch sides in three. Switch your sides in two. And one. Left leg stays extended. Take it to a passe slide through a right leg. Inhale, bend. Exhale, press. Little lower. Press. Lower. Squeeze. You've got it. Maybe you lift your head and your shoulders just a little bit higher from your mat. Engage your core even more. You've got this rib cage in this together. Belly bun down and toward your spine. Tiny lower. Lift. Point through your toes. Ooh, super strong and lean through your left leg. Keep it up for four. Oh yeah, we take it to alterations in three. Last two. And one, alternate sides, a little lower through your left. Lift and squeeze, lower through your right. Lift and squeeze, you've got a head, neck and shoulders lift. Who gaze goes up towards the ceiling. Leave space between your chin and your chest. Alternate your sides all the way down. And squeeze up, all the way down. Squeeze at the top. You've got to give me four. Land with your left leg bent in three. Left leg bent in two, and one. Left leg bent, only crunch, inhale, lower. Exhale, crunch, inhale, lower down. Exhale, crunch up. Drive your right elbow towards your left knee. I still want you to pull through your legs, but again, know that you can always pinch your right foot down and hold your left knee right next to it. Drive The focus here is to drive your elbow towards your knee. Inhale, lower. Exhale, crunch, start to fire up through your obliques. One count down, one count up. You've got this. Ooh, a little tap down, squeeze to the top. We're gonna switch sides in five. You've got it, don't miss this, give me four. Take it directly into your right side in three. Last two, and one, right knee bends, Swing through your right toes and now lower. Exhale, crunch, this time drag your left elbow toward your right knee, all the way down and up. Inhale, lower, exhale, drive. You've got this, you're swing through your toes. You guys are almost out of this. You have worked so incredibly hard for me and I'm so happy that you guys are all here with me right now. Keep it up, you've got seven more reps. Just a little bit more core work left. You can. Give me three. Heels kiss at the top in two. And one. Kiss your heels at the top. We've got smileys. Inhale lower and lift to the left. Inhale lower center. Exhale up to the right. Little swirl to the left. Swirl to the right. And I'm going to take this at a different angle so you can see it just a little bit more. Know that on this you can put your palms underneath your glutes. Heels kiss poise. Toes kiss back towards your face. Inhale lower. Exhale lift. Little swirl to the right. Swirl to the left. Whew. If you want a little bit of an up level, take your fingertips behind your ears, lift your head, neck, and shoulders. You've got this little rock to the left, rock to the right, rock to the left, rock to the right. You've got five more reps. You have one more core exercise after this. Give me three. Strongest yet, last two. And one, stand your heels, elbows and knees. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, crunch, lengthen, and crunch. You've got this, this is it. This is where you finish. Stick with me, push just a little bit harder. Dig just a little bit deeper. I know you can do this. You've got seven more reps. We take it right into our cool down. I know that's what you guys all came for. 
in five. Give me four. Knees to your chest in three, two, and one. Draw your knees into your chest. Rock and roll side to side, forward and back. I appreciate all the incredible hard work that you just put in on your mats. Give your back a little bit of massage. Check in with your breath and all the hard work that you just did on your mats and with this entire community today. When you're ready, place your right foot down on your mat. Lift your left ankle a bit over. Find a figure four stretch. Flex through your left toes. Melt your head, neck, and shoulders if you want. If you would like, you can take the bind, drive your knees into your chest. Continue to melt your head, neck, and shoulders down into your mat. Focus in on your breath and all the hard work that you just put on. And if the music is still bumping, know that there's some slower music towards the end of the playlist. It's going to really help you out. So. You've got to keep it up. We're going to switch sides in three. Last two. And one. Make sure to your legs from right to left. And when you're ready, plant your opposite leg down, left foot plants, right ankle lifts up and over. Take the same option here as it on the other side. Either you plant your foot or drive your knees into your chest. Kind of your slice through your toes. Take one more deep breath in. Exhale, let it go. Windshield wipe your legs from right to left. And then extend your left leg long. Draw your right knee towards your chest. Give it a tight squeeze. Pull it out towards your shoulder and on your exhale. Shoot it all the way across your body. Supine twist. And neck and shoulders belt down into your mat. Face falls in the opposite direction. Deep breath in. Exhale, let it go. Hug your knees into your chest. Extend your right leg long. Left knee hold in tight. Pull it out towards your shoulder. And on your exhale, shoot it all the way across your body. Face falls in the opposite direction. One more deep breath in. Exhale, let it go. Knee drive in towards your chest. Draw your forehead up to your knees. Appreciate all the hard work that you just put it on your mats. And when you're ready, release everything out onto the sweetest of all shavasanas. I'll pull your arm just a few. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, let it go. When you're ready, start to bring the small movements to your wrists, to your ankles. Allow that energy to transfer all the way up into your fingers, your toes. Maybe your head rocks and roll from right to left. And on your exhale, bring one hand to your heart, one hand to your stomach. Feel your heartbeat, feel your breath flow, and feel forever grateful for both of those things and even extra grateful for both of those things in times like this. Appreciate the people that are surrounding you right here in this workout and the people in your own home that you get to hang out every single day. Together, we bring our hands to Third Eye Center, the soft spot between our eyes. The student and teacher in me is incredibly inspired and motivated by each and every one of you here today. Together, we bow to life before us saying, Namaste. Oh. You guys, thank you so much for coming and hanging out with me. I am so grateful that all of you guys came and hung out. Oh, Ashley, Emily, so many super amazing people. Um, and if you're not watching this live, uh, know that I'm super excited that you're coming to check it out. And hopefully you continue to check out a bunch of new classes. Thank you guys so much. Have a great rest of your day. Go on a walk, hug your pups, hug your, hug your people. Love you all. Bye.